all right this is the model of the question so we have to go ahead to take our measurements now with a meter rule okay um this is the first one m1 okay i have m1 is equal to 2.5 so i have to multiply by 20 that gives me 50 newton the second one here okay 3.3 m2 equals 3.3 times 20 that give me 66 newton okay third one 3.8 m3 is 3.8 multiply by 20 that give me 96 newton okay that's the number four 5.2 m4 is 5.2 multiply by 20 that gives me um one uh, 104 104 newton 104 uh, uh, one. last one here okay 6.1 m5 is 6.1 times 20 i have a 122 newton all right that is for the masses for uh the, sorry the weight of the spring ballast okay now we'll go ahead to measure the corresponding angle that is a model of the corresponding angle so we need a protractor you place a protractor over it to measure it so we we'll do that now okay tracing it might be a little bit confusing here so we we'll just use a ruler to extend it a little bit and you have to be very careful here you have to be very very careful I'm to introduce your error okay okay so we can read it off now easily this is 24 degree this is um 32 degree it's 38 degree uh, it's 52 degree and this is 63 degree accurate so which means at theta 1 theta 2 3 4 and 5 is represented at okay so which is 24 32 38 52 and 63 so the next thing we need to do now is to take these values and then prepare our table of reading that will be the next thing to do